Good morning, everybody. I'd just like to share with you how lovely it is to share love and blessings and warm, good, healthy wishes with people in your morning time. So we all have, let's say, a little morning routine. And often our morning routine can be in a rush. Eating, dressing, showering and running out the door. But I'd like to suggest to you, if, if you feel like it, to get up a little bit earlier maybe. and Or just spend a little bit of time in your commute to, to work or school or wherever you're going. Or even before you leave the door. If you could spend a little bit of time to just think of some people in your life, maybe family, friends, workmates, or people who have hurt you or whom you've argued with recently. And I ask you to con consider or contemplate the effects and how it would feel to just think of them for a few moments and even everybody on earth and in the entire galaxy that we live in in our neighboring galaxies and the entire huge huge universe and send out love and light and healing and well-being wishes and loving intentions to all life beings and civilizations and people and individuals and all life forms all levels of consciousness in the entire universe wish them well and abundance and prosperity and do this in your day not just in the morning time but have this vibrational frequency which is measurable and it's shown by Dr. Emoto by freezing water and you can see the beautiful sacred geometry and symmetry in these frozen water crystals so remember the power of your mind and your heart especially and never have a closed heart towards people because it hurts you so much to have a closed heart it cuts you off from the universe it cuts you off from happiness and joy and lightness and love and peace so don't have an open heart towards some people, but a closed heart towards others. Have an open heart towards everybody, okay? And somebody on Facebook today asked me, well, it's hard to, to, um, it's hard to love people who are mean to you. And I said, understand people and you can love them. Ask the universe that you want to experience or know how to experience more compassion and empathy and you will be shown. It will appear to you if your eyes and ears are open. You will be shown and guided how to experience and feel what you want to experience in life. I did this. I did it this year with compassion and empathy and I was definitely more or less, I was answered. I learned how. So I said one way to experience I said, you, if you start thinking about and trying to understand why somebody was mean, start spending a little bit of time to think and understand why, as in all of the reasons why they may be mean, their hurts and their traumas and their hardships in life, their sadness and loneliness and despair, It'll bring a tear to your eye and then you'll have already experienced compassion and love towards that person. So, so wish them well and send them healing blessings and wishes. Um, so this is really powerful send these blessings and wishes to everybody we can all do it. it it raises our vibration so much it's powerful 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 stuff so let's raise our vibration and let's raise our vibration with other stuff like early nights not not because part of raising our vibration is not actually raising it but not doing the things that lower it and big things lower it such as eating junk and heavy foods 
fake foods, addictive food chemicals, etc. Uh, I believe meat definitely lowers our vibration. Eating a lot of meat or dairy or chemical foods. Um, not getting enough early nights or enough sleep definitely compromises our physical health and our vibration. Um, watching and spending time with or reading stuff of a lower vibration. People, magazines, YouTube, music, ego stuff full of fear and judgment and attack etc. That'll all lower your vibration. So, um, so just eat more lighter fruits, more raw foods, more fruits, easy to digest raw foods, uh, low fat and and this is what I noticed the biggest difference in my life and my expanded awareness in the moment. Uh, feeling that extra dimension of who I am behind and beyond the thoughts. So when I eat lightly with high fruits or lots of or even fruit juices with no cooked foods or very very little cooked foods, I just feel the best ever. So it's obviously things that are bogging me, bogging me down, and I notice a profound, huge, life-changing difference. So, so much love to you, and blessings. Uh, I wish you and your family and everybody on Earth, everybody, one human family, one cosmic family, love and light, blessings to everybody, and all the plants and animals, all the lovely dogs and, pi and pigs. They're gorgeous the horses, the bushes, the hedges, and all the little microorganisms, the insects, they're all beautiful, the trees, the sky, <laughs> the clouds, the fresh air, the natural food that grows for us, so just, just thank you so much. So live in a state of gratitude, <clears throat> spend a bit of time to think about it, and you're going to feel so good, and as you feel so gooder and gooder, you're going to be automatically changing the vibration of those around you and every moment that you go to, every place. <sighs> so I'll see you again next video and um, you're welcome to share for other people and to subscribe if you haven't already. Um, you're welcome to give the video a like. Uh, your thanks for all the Thanksgiving. You're also welcome, if you, some people have asked me uh, that do I have a donation link? Because some people w w felt inspired to give me a donation, which I totally and utterly love. <laughs> so you're welcome to give a donation if you feel inspired to. And uh, um, I don't have a donation link, but if you like it, you can just send it to my my um, PayPal email address. I'll put put the thing below in the description under the video. And if you want to give me a donation, I'll feel extremely happy and grateful. It's like it's like a little party you're giving me, so it's totally helpful in my life, and it's just a thoroughly joyful, lovely thing to do. If you feel like it, if you feel inspired, and so thanks for your time, and be very well in life, and I'll talk to you again soon. Okay, bye.